And when we've been there ten thousand years, bright shining as the sun, we've no less days to sing God's grace than when we'd first begun. I work at the thrift store in Mount Erie and I would lost my insurance and I, I told my co-workers that I lost my insurance and they said, well, just go to the church at the top of the hill, Mission of Mercy goes there. And you just sign in if you don't have insurance, you go just go there and sign in and they'll take care of you. And I, I didn't think it was going to be the, you know, that easy and that great, but it was. And I have a lot of medical problems, I have a lot of medications that I have to take, and I didn't know what I was going to do. I've had a double mastectomy. Um, I have a seizure disorder. I have back problems. I've had back surgery. I have high blood pressure, high cholesterol. I'm diabetic. You have to get all that under control with medications and going to the doctors and I didn't know what I was going to do. It's medications that you have to take. I didn't know where, where I was going to turn to until I found Mission of Mercy. We have seen over a hundred patients in one day. Yeah, so it's, it's, it's not unusual to stay one, one and a half hours later than the usual closing time just to make sure that no one is turned away. We provide, we provide good traditional Western health care, but the difference is we do it in such a way that love is present. And you can feel the difference when you're at the clinic. I tried to go to a bunch of different dentists, but because of all my my health problems, uh, they wouldn't take me, or if they would take me, I couldn't afford it. My teeth have been neglected for so long because my son is actually going to be 12 and needs braces, so I want to make sure that he gets the braces before I get my dental work done. He has insurance, but the insurance wouldn't cover all of it, so I saved all the money he needs to get everything that he needs. And my son's getting his braces next month. Because I didn't want the same thing to happen to my children, what happened to my teeth. My younger son is actually at the dentist now and I couldn't be with him. We say that our product is, is not medicine. You know, our, our product is God's love. And that's why we can't charge anything. You know, if our product was medicine, you can justify charging something. But if our product is God's love, it's got to be free. This is all happening because God is in charge. He owns this and we don't claim ownership. Every dollar that's invested saves a community 18 or more. We want to grow the number of days that we're able to serve in the communities. Uh, maybe in the next uh, few years we'll be able to actually double the number of patient visits that we're able to provide. This is exactly why I went to medical school. Taking care of these people really makes you feel good at the end of the day. I never knew that there was a place that you could come to and they treat you like a real person. They treat you with compassion and it's very comforting. The opportunity to do this work is an opportunity to touch people in a way that I never did before. Um, possibly it's my salvation. But now I'm found was blind, but now I see.